All right, everybody, we are fucking back for some more fucking game. Um, what I need to do real quickly though is I don't. Um, I was gonna load the game, but fuck it. Who cares about the time, really? But um, grab your shit, motherfuckers. If you don't got your shit, you better fucking get up and fucking get your shit because motherfuckers, I fucking got my shit. So let's fucking do this shit, niggas. Guys, welcome to part fucking sixteen. Um, we're about to get fucking our asses whooped because we all know how this ends. It seems your moves were too fast for the runs to catch, but I can see them clear as day. I admire your confidence, Vegeta, but I'm afraid your mind is so overcome with fear that you've become delusional. You won't be laughing for very long, Frieza. After all, you're up against your greatest fear. A Super Saiyan! Frieza's final form. <laughs> you uh -oh. haven't lost your ridiculous sense of humor. There won't be a need for Kakarot when I'm done! I can see you! He's like, I can see you! Well, I think I play with you after all. You wanna play that far away? Fine! Nope. Wrong button! That was quick. Impossible. This can't be happening. I am a Super Saiyan! Go to hell, Frieza! Look at him. He's like, how? That was all my power. I don't believe it. This can't be. Absurd. This can't be the extent of my power. Are you finished? I think I'll make the next move. I'll be gentle. For the very first time in his life, Vegeta had finally begun to experience true dread. Wow. Talk about humbling. Overcome with hopelessness and frustration, he was reduced to tears. The mighty prince of the warrior race had lost his will to fight. Here comes the back punches. It's just not in the waterfall this time. Save him, feel free to try it any time. That scene was intense when he's just sitting there punching him and he legitimately says that to them and they just stand there and do nothing. Whoa! I'm overflowing with power! 
It's actually kind of freaking me out. Whoa, I better get going. Hang on, guys, I'm on my way. Well, let's fucking go. They're not too far. Here I come, here I come, here I come. Let's. I'm gonna change my palette around. Because I definitely want. I gotta find some reds. Hold up, bitches. I gotta find some fucking. Frieza, Gohan, Krillin, and Vegeta are all there. And there's someone else there too. I don't know who it is, but red power is incredible. Wait, there's something familiar about it. Is that Piccolo? Oh, I get it. He must have been wished back with the Dragon Balls. Come on, you another red. Come on, guys, give me another set of red. Vegeta's power is getting weaker and weaker by the second. I thought he was stronger than this. Ooh, Spirit Bomb and Kamehameha. Okay, we're gonna leave it how it is right now. Um, so we don't need that. We can actually go fight because I'm not using meteor. I'm using rock paper scissors. Hang on, guys. Might cause some trouble later. Best to deal with this now. Hmm. Sorry I'm late. I'll take things from here. Dad? Uh, Goku! It looks like I still have some trash to dispose of. Kakarot. Hmm. Kakarot. Oh, I see. So you're a Saiyan as well. I intend to rid the universe of every last one of you. Fuck off, nigga. There's something different about Kakarot. Has he finally done it? Is he a Super Saiyan? Not yet, bitch. You actually countered one of my attacks. I'm impressed. <laughs> Frieza, I'd get serious if I were you. You're finally face to face with your worst nightmare. Uh, a Super Saiyan! The, the legendary Saiyan warrior, the strongest fighter in the universe. <laughs> You're... Finish, Frieza. <laughs> You're finally going to get what you. Did I not make myself clear before? I've grown tired of your pathetic jokes. Stop! Don't you see he can't fight back anymore? He's done. Just let him go. Kakarot, you're just as soft as always. Perhaps you're not a Super Saiyan after all. <laughs> you idiot. Stop letting your emotions hold you back. Stop being so soft and you can finally do it. You can become a Super Saiyan. Kakarot, listen. Our home planet, Planet Vegeta, 
wasn't destroyed by a meteor. It, it was Frieza. We, we Saiyans, we Saiyans were his enforcers. We followed his every order. Hmm. Your parents, my father, the king, they, they were all murdered by that monster. I beg you, Kakarot, please, please defeat Frieza. Please, I beg of you. He must die by saying hands. Vegeta. Man, this scene got me too in the anime because I was a kid when I saw this. I was wondering when he'd finally die. I couldn't believe that Vegeta was dead. Vegeta, it must have been really difficult for a proud guy like you to beg me for help. I hated you at first, but I began to understand over time you were a proud Saiyan warrior. Just know this. I'll do what I can to carry on that pride of yours. Hey, I'm a Saiyan raised on Earth. And to avenge those you've brutally murdered. The Saiyans and the Namekians. I'm going to defeat you! Utter nonsense. Let's do this, Goku. We're just in the way. We need to get out of here. Once again, Piccolo's useless. Go on. Come on, hurry! Please don't die, Dad! Make Frieza pay for what he did! Hey, motherfucker. You dirty bitch, you're hitting me now. This is horseshit. about that. This has been fun. It's been quite some time since I've exerted myself this much. Man, I'm in trouble. If he's serious about the half power thing, then even the Kaioken times ten isn't gonna be enough. 
I should be able to hold my own if I push it to times 20, though. My body might not be able to handle it, but I've got to try! Not good. What's going on? It, it barely, it barely did a thing. My dad's energy, it's a lot weaker than it was before. I can't believe someone's actually that strong. Guess King Kai was right. Can't believe I'm saying this. But we shouldn't have picked this fight with Frieza. yourself already <coughs> I mean I did just fuck your shit fucking <coughs> 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 sideways seems like Goku's got something in the works <coughs> Spirit bomb bitches Not yet. The spirit bomb. I need a little help, though. All Keep them off of me. And all planets that can hear me, lend me as much energy as you can. Give me the strength I need. What are you doing? Don't tell me. Is this another one of your pathetic attacks? What can you possibly accomplish by just standing there? Just watch, bitch. <clears throat> well, he's made a spirit bomb that huge? Frieza doesn't appear to know what's going on right now. Nope. I don't understand why Goku doesn't just attack him. Not ready. He's probably thinking that he needs more energy so that he can take Frieza down for good this time. <coughs> Man. I wish this thing didn't take so long to get ready. I have to make sure he doesn't figure out what I'm doing. Come on! This is getting ridiculous. How much longer do you intend to keep that up? <laughs> Not sure. As long as I have to, I guess. <laughs> Say, uh, you're not in a hurry, are you? You dare mock me? Mm-hmm. Oh, shit. I do not understand, you Saiyans. Your kind has been a thorn in my side for as long as I can remember. You've been a thorn in ours. I destroyed that Saiyan child and this entire planet. The Saiyans will finally be no more. Legend of the Super Saiyan will remain One more. That. And then I have to stop. That's not the sub. Yes, it is. <clears throat> sure. We saw it. Stay here. No matter what happens, do not leave this spot. 
What is that? Is that some sort of ball of energy? You! It's no use. If I launch the spirit bomb at him right now, he's just gonna dodge it. Besides, it doesn't even have enough power to take Frieza down. Ah, damn it! You were planning a sneak attack this whole time. How pathetic! But all of your idiotic planning and effort has gone to waste. You're finished! Piccolo! Hurry up and finish that spirit bomb already! Thanks, Piccolo. You fight! Oh, shit! I always interfere. So there are more of you, are there? <laughs> you certainly know how to test my limited patience. Uh oh. It ends now. I will reduce you and this entire planet to nothing but ashes. Nope. All right. Ready. It's done. Release it. Take that, motherfucker. Supposed to be a big old hole. Like a big hole. Krillin! <clears throat> hey, you made it. Yeah! Dad and Piccolo. They were right by the impact, weren't they? You, you don't think that they? Hey, it happens. Goku and Piccolo were talking about. They wouldn't go down that easy. It's a fucking spirit bomb, bitch. What the fuck do you mean? The energy's faint, but I feel it. Right, come on, let's go. Okay. Dad. Goku! You did it! <laughs> Let's go home, you guys. <gasps> what is it, Krillin? <clears throat> totally forgot about Bulma! Don't scare me like that. <laughs> uh, no. <coughs> it can't be! Freeze up! Piccolo! You worms. I'm going to eradicate every last one of you. Krillin, run! Krillin! No! Let him go, Freeza! Go, go! Man. That was brutal. And now for the little brat. Uh oh. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, bitches. Now I'm the fucking Super Saiyan.
Dad? Gohan, take Piccolo with you and head back to Earth now! Uh, uh, Hurry, Gohan! Before I lose what little sense of reason I have left! Uh, 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 okay! What's going on? What's happened to him? No, it can't be! I, I think I know what's going on. My dad finally did it! He's become a Super Saiyan! I've had enough! Now I'm mad, Frieza! You will know your place, you filthy Saiyan! What you think, motherfucker? Hold on, guys. I got my music back going again. What? Of course. Here we go. Return to battle. You have some nerve. Your friend. You have the seeds with just as much blood on their hands. Thanks. I exterminated them like the pest they were. Now it's your turn to be exterminated! Your energy! But now, Saiyan! Give it up, Alfred. You're finished! Get out of here, Frieza! Fuck out of here, Frieza! You can destroy entire planets, but you can't take down one single person? What are you? You mean you haven't figured it out yet? I'm the Saiyan who's come all the way from Earth to defeat you! Fuck now, Frieza! I am the warrior you've heard of in legends. I am pure of heart and awakened by fury. That's what I am. I am the Super Saiyan, Son Goku! <laughs> And corrected. I suppose the legends were true after all. I hate you. I hate you. It's over, Frieza. Is it now? I won't let it end this way. I would rather take my own life than be killed by scum like you. Fine by me. The one that's going to die isn't me. It'll be you! <laughs> I can survive in the vacuum of space. Let's find out if the same can be said for Saiyan. Not true, Vegeta was in space when he blew up a planet. too much but the core has been completely destroyed 
In five minutes time, this planet will explode and become nothing more than debris floating through space. <laughs> well, that's all the time I know. I'll avenge someone by defeating you. Then find my friends and get out of here. <coughs> Me and <Seba. coughs> choice. It's time to show you. Prepare for my soul power. Do it, bitch. Okay. As a warrior, I wouldn't have it any other way. Besides, you want to test out your full power too, don't you? My apologies for the wait. As requested, this is my full power! <clears throat> We're in trouble now. Goku Struggler. At this rate, he might not be able to make it off planet Namek before it explodes. No way! Yes, way. There must be something we can do. Wait, that's it? Yes, that should work! <laughs> Guardian of Earth, Kami, can you hear me? Yes, King Kai. I can hear you. Will you be able to summon Shenron right away? I have a wish to make. Ah, oh, yes. I've already had Mr. Popo gather all of the Dragon Balls. We were planning to use them to revive those currently in your care. Right. Because Earth Dragon Balls can revive many people at once. But can they revive those who died naturally? I'm afraid those who died of natural causes cannot be brought back. But what about those whose lives were shortened as a result of an encounter with a villain? I mean it. Hmm. I suppose such people could be revived, if only for the brief time that was taken from them. All right then, here's the wish. Ask Shenron to bring back all those that were killed by Frieza and his men. What? I'll explain. We don't have much time, so I'll make this quick. First, we'll use the Earth Dragon Balls to revive all those killed by Frieza. That should mean all the Mechians, including Grand Elder Guru, should be revived. Two of the three wishes granted within the Mechian Dragon Ball. Now, very strange. With Grand Elder Guru back, we should still be able to make one last wish, right? With that last wish, we'll transport everyone on Namek other than Frieza to Earth. Oh, I get it! You've really thought this through, King Kai. Anyway, that's the gist of it. Now hurry! Planet Namek won't be around much longer! Whoa. Oh, I see. I'll summon Shenron right away. Now, state your wish. I shall grant you any wish that you desire. Of 
story recap. Try me. What are you talking about? Are you talking about Krillin? He sure is. Don't you dare talk about Krillin! Get him. I swear to God, if it's another fucking loading screen, I'm gonna lose my shit. Okay. There should be one wish left with the Dragon Balls there. I need you to summon Shenron. For the last wish, ask him to send everyone there except Frieza to Earth. No, you mean Paranga. I understand, King Kai. I never noticed it fucked up on that one. Concern, but wishes must be made directly, I'm afraid. I will contact whomever is closest to the Dragon Balls and tell them your wish. Wait! Don't make that wish! Listen to me. Ask him to leave both Frieza and me behind. Come on, ask him! You heard us, Goku? I, I understand what you're trying to do, but... Listen, King Kai, if you don't let me finish things with Frieza, I'm never going to forgive you! Fine, fine. I understand. If that's really what you want.
My children, this huh? is a planet called Earth. My time is once again at hand, I'm afraid. But before I leave this world once more, I wish to explain what has just happened. <coughs> The battle against that fiend Frieza still continues back on our home planet. <laughs> Would you look at that? You need to speak the local language in order to make a wish. It's just us now, Frieza. Me and you! Finally, I've been waiting for this. How very curious. It would seem you're willing to pay the ultimate price to settle our conflict. Very well. Thanks for watching.